What's up guys, Curtis here, um, Michigan Hunting Nation. Right now we're gonna be putting together the uh, Bighorn Ranch Fire Pit. And we're gonna be doing a video installation and review for you guys. Uh, we've heard great things about this. We plan on bringing this to deer camp. Um, you can even bring this over to um, ice fishing camp if you want, put it on the ice, uh, grill up some fresh walleye out of the ice hole. Um, there's just so many different things you can do for catch and cook or a hunt and cook. Um, so stay tuned. We're going to put this thing together. Hopefully it doesn't take too long and uh, we'll get cooking and see, uh, let you guys know what we think about it. Thanks for tuning in. We're also doing this with three crazy kids running around us, so bear with us. Looks like it also comes with a cover and then a uh, accessory grate for charcoal grilling and stuff like that, so pretty cool. What's up guys, so we just finished the assembly of the Bighorn Ranch Fire Pit. This thing is awesome. We got it for uh, just under 200 bucks at Lowe's with military discount. So thank you Lowe's for the military discount. That definitely helps us out. And this thing is no joke. It's got the foot rail along here. Um, it's just your standard nuts and bolts assembly. All of it comes in parts, but um, all you need are just a few tools here. Uh, this size right here is a 3 8 for the nuts. Um, and either a drill or a screwdriver. Yeah, either a drill or a screwdriver. Uh, for this part right here, this was probably the biggest pain, which is weird because it's the smallest part, the handle, but just because of where the- uh, Screws go in. Yeah, so I used like a pretty long, um, pretty long shaft for the Phillips. But all in all, 30 minutes with the two of us, not too bad. This thing seems built very well. I like that it has this swing away option or you can just pull this thing out, pull this pin out. This pulls right out and if you're not gonna cook or whatever. You can store it away. Just store it and then, uh, yeah, you got yourself a nice fire here. They got this nice log rack. That, the uh, ash catcher. Yep ash catcher below which is nice because we have like a carpet under here then what you can also do is you can flip it around so that the log holder is underneath and that ash um tray goes up top and becomes a charcoal tray for if you want to actually charcoal grow on your fire pit <laughs> yep so i'd probably recommend the charcoal grilling if you're gonna uh, cook like a thick steak or something like that but the burgers that i make are pretty thin you smash them down venison burgers that my wife uh we got made with my wife's first buck and nice six point so probably gonna cook those up or find something else to cook but this thing is just amazing for um like i said deer camp um you could probably if, you, if the ice is thick enough and you have a utility trailer uh like i used to that i would pull behind my four-wheeler out on the ice i would just load this thing on there and uh especially if you're gonna stay out on the ice like Saginaw Bay or something like that throughout the weekend. Um, put this thing on there. It's actually not as heavy as it looks. Um, and you got yourself not only a fire pit out on the ice or at deer camp, but you got a whole barbecue grilling set. Even a stove, really, because you could put like a cast iron up here and uh and cook that way too. Absolutely. So, so it'll be perfect. The kids are so excited for s'mores and yep. the first fire with our new bighorn. Hey, what's up guys? Curtis here with Michigan Hunting Nation. Uh, we're out here, obviously now it's nighttime and we got this thing going. This thing is absolutely amazing. Uh, what do you think, Mel? It's awesome. Yep. So far for 200 bucks from Lowe's, this thing is, we love it. We absolutely love it. So. Check out the Bighorn Rancher Fire Pit. 
And like I said, um, if you don't want to cook on it, this thing just pulls out so that it swings away. Just, just have a regular fire pit. Just a regular fire pit, yep. Yeah. 